We start off today with a huge announcement from the governor as he unveiled South Carolina's largest economic development announcement in history today. A maker of electric vehicle battery components is bringing, get this, a $3.5 billion investment to Berkeley County. Redwood Materials is the manufacturing company. It says it will bring 1,500 new jobs to that area. The company's more than 600-acre campus will be located at the Camp Hill Commerce Park in Ridgeville and initially produce enough material for 100 gigawatt hours of battery cell production or 1 million electric vehicles. This is a transformative thing. Electric vehicles, we're into that. We have manufacturers here, as everybody knows, and uh, we issued an executive order a couple of months ago to get all the agencies working together, Department of Transportation, Department of Commerce, everybody in between, to be sure that we are, we are ready for that. The, the market is going to demand that, and, and we're going to be ready for it. Uh, but this is transformative, and it's, uh, it's going to open the door to the future of innovation and imagination in South Carolina, and I'll promise you our people are ready, ready for that. We're ready to meet that challenge, and that's why you're here today. Redwood Materials says by creating a circular supply chain in the U.S. for electric vehicles, it will drive down costs and emissions related to the supply chain. It also reclaims and recycles batteries and production scrap to create battery components. Operations at that facility expected to begin sometime next year. Major job news like this is welcome, but now comes the part of making sure the state's workforce is ready to take on those new positions. News 19's Nigel Hood has more on how the state might go about training people for this new opportunity. Redwood Materials will be using the South Carolina facility to produce anode and cathode battery components for electric vehicles. They'll be working with the South Carolina Technical College system to train students on the skills they'll need for these jobs. It's the uh largest announcement in the history of the state so those do not come along uh, very often. That's how State Tech College System President Dr. Tim Hardy describes the impact. According to the South Carolina Department of Commerce, these battery components will be built from recyclable materials and cut down on carbon emissions. Ready SC is a division of the South Carolina Technical College System that trains students in new industries. Very successful with the large industries in South Carolina like BMW and Michelin and Boeing over the years and I think because of our success with training people for those industries it actually helps us to attract people like Red Red Materials because we have a proven track record of providing a workforce. Charleston's Trident Technical College president, Dr. Mary Thornley, says representatives from the program will take a discovery trip to the company's headquarters in Nevada. When Ready SC has their discovery trip to northern Nevada, Trident Tech will also provide two or three employees to go learn from the get-go what we need to know to develop what we don't have. The plant says it will be operational at some point next year, but didn't give a specific month. In Columbia, Nigel Hood, News 19, WLTX. The company is encouraging people interested in working for them to go to their website. We have a link to that website on ours. Just go to WLTX.com or look for this story on our News 19 mobile app.